Hello everyone. Have you visited Anguilla? Today we took the ferry from Marigo over to Anguilla. It's only $30 one way and takes about 20 minutes. Anguilla has some of the best beaches in the Caribbean and Shoal Bay has been written up as one of the 10 best in the world. So follow us, the Adventures of CNC, for a tour of Anguilla. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Chances along with my Got a handcuff. Oh boy, he's in trouble. <laughs> you can't go to the next island, honey. You need to be better at night. <laughs> and not such a troublemaker. Can't help it. Anyway, I'll see you on the way back. <laughs> I'll miss you. <laughs> Off to Anguilla. This is Marigold, and this is where the ever popular movie was filmed, right in this harbor. Marigold is on the French side of St. Martin. The reason why I can tell you that because I'm working with the same group. I organize the transport for the same group that's in there right now. I think our first stop we will, we will make it that Mariana. Okay. When I do the first stop love to start in Angola. Open up November 1st, 1984. 
red carbon currency and dollars. But yeah, but it's strictly more dollars than it's red carbon currency. And most all of the prices of that island are in dollars. Where's the dollars? On the left, we have a row and one. The golf course, located in there. An 18 hole, and a 9 hole. Okay. Golf course, designed by Great Norman. Great Norman. Welcome to Maliawana. Maliawana put Anguilla on the map as the ultimate luxury getaway. This oceanfront resort continues to set the standard for modern day island glamour. Set atop a bluff that rolls down to pristine white sands and blue sea. Maliawana exudes the magic of Anguilla with spacious beachfront accommodations, cascading infinity pools with dramatic views, and their award-winning spa. It took some practicing for me to get this name correctly, Malioana, and I was so curious as to where that name came from. Approximately 3,500 years ago, a tribe of Amerindians left their native land of South America and sailed out to find a new home. They settled on what is now called Anguilla, a 20-mile long sandbar off the coast of Simartin. They named the island Malioana, which meant arrow-headed sea serpent in their native so language cool. of Arawak. Looks like holes, but mirrors you can see everyone's shadow beautiful resort Beautiful infinity pool. Ah, oh, that's gorgeous down in there. Wow. We have all fallen in love with Malioana and we are planning our next trip back. How quickly can we come back to Anguilla and stay at this resort? We have found out that depending on the time of year, you can get rooms ranging about $500 a night. This is definitely a treat. This place is just gorgeous. This is the beach by Maiwana. Not sure if I pronounced that correctly. Look how beautiful and clear. Fishing, a whole bunch of little beach. 
big fish scooting around. It's lovely. I love the mirror tiles. Some cute stuff in the blue store. So pretty. Peaceful sitting areas everywhere. Mm, look at the conch shells. You could play, be playing backgammon right here with that view. Cheers, guys. Cheers. To Anguilla. To Anguilla. To Anguilla. Woo! You coming back to this. <laughs> oh, you, you switched to Karen now. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm in. Anytime somebody says, let's travel, I'm in. <laughs> so this is the life, guys, right? Everybody having fun? What are we doing, Renee? Oh, here she is. You having fun, Renee? I'm having a blast. You're ready to stay, right? I love it here. I'm staying. All right. Let's have pretty. So there's two infinity pools, one flowing into the other. How beautiful. The gardens are just lovely. But look at this pool. Mm -mm -mm. A massage at poolside with this view. What do you think? Can you handle it? This is one infinity pool and you can barely see, but it flows down into a second infinity pool. And then you look right out at the ocean. How beautiful is this? Mahiwana into Anguilla. So there's all kinds of ways to pay for travel. And I'm trading some cleaning for travel to stay into this beautiful hotel. If I can do it, you can do it. Let's go. I usually don't record the restroom. But this is a real pretty one, so I thought I would get this. You can even sit here and hang out. How about that? But it's time to leave, so we are just dragging our feet out of here. Arnell. Ready, Ron? <laughs> ah, and the nice chair. <laughs> Let's say goodbye to Molly, Juana. My name is Ron up there. Yeah, Chuck Norris. Yeah. 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 Now he's in the Gulf Castle. Castle get a strike with a hurricane. Then I open. So Chuck Norris was with that house, and his wife she sold the house. Diane Harris, she sold the house. I remember last time we. She sold the house. Yeah. He's still alive, right? Yeah. They got the I don't know. Yeah. There's a lot of luxury apartments. Yeah, I think she's still alive. It's kind of comfortable. It's kind of weird.
This is the arch in Anguilla. It's like a natural bridge been carved out by the ocean. How cool. Maybe we could go swimming down in there, Donna. What do you think? It's pretty, right? Got all the cliff inside. Gorgeous. Oh wow. Over there. Go to the rain. I'm coming to hit you. You let it out, you catch fish. Yeah. Yep. Beautiful. You get a chance snapper over there. That's beautiful, huh? That's Prickly Pear Island over there. I thought I was Prickly Pear. And that dog, dog island over there. Ah, uh, yeah. What you call and that dog? Sandy Island over dog. there. Dog Island. Dog. And Sandy Island is one that just looks like a little bit like over there. Yeah. Moving by the rest of that. And that's where he was. On top of the point over there, the red roof? Yes. Ah, uh, yeah. That's where And another one there, the yeah, four we'll season, we're we'll going back there now. Beans and rice. Beans and rice and fish, the national dish. Oh, and that rhymes. Well, that's right. Look at it. Yeah. And they also, they used to have a little rock water inside in the yard that they used to do the cooking. All right. They had rock water. Like a little outside kitchen. Outside kitchen, yeah. <laughs> See the cotton? Many oh, years yeah. ago, cotton was the main industrial in Anguilla oh. many years ago. You see the cotton on the trees? Yeah. yeah. So now, whenever rain would fall, they spread up all over the island. Ah. You don't have to plant in the rock, but let's grow them. Wow. See, I just spread out with this small, I see the green, green tree over there? Yeah. The little yellow flower? That's a cotton tree over there, too. Oh, wow. How long since you've been driving taxi? I started driving taxi for 1980. Wow. You've driven a lot there. Uh... In those days, we're hardly in the, in the work for taxi. There was no work for taxis today. There was nobody coming to the island. Coming, yeah. That's when we got to open our doors for tourism in 1984. Cool. This used to be a salt pond. I was just going to ask you if this was a salt pond. I still see like salt on the rocks. I didn't, I didn't repair salt from this pond. I harvest from the other one. I didn't say it's wood. Oh. Yeah, that's where we started out. That's where we started out. So cute. Look at it. Save it. Yeah. Yes, I do. I don't know if they would find those cells. Beautiful plumeria trees. Look at that huge piece of driftwood and these long gangways. So pretty, it's like in Hawaii with the plumeria trees everywhere. Just lovely.
Mission Viva. It's a beautiful village. Yeah, let's go. Inside them is beautiful in our town. Oh, wow. Karen, it's for the Karen to food. Nice. Just food. And the drive, they have yeah. one golf cart. They just the south to the beach of Cap. Wow, the beautiful. Wow. Look it's a beautiful view going in. Beautiful. It is beautiful. Most beautiful view. Yeah. It's nice. Cap is a very famous resort. Yeah. Is this the one that's being sold? Yeah. Is that all salt on the side? Yeah. No, that's, that's a foam. A lot of water, a lot of rainfall, a lot of wind blows, the water caps. Oh, so and that's a foam that's up. No, that's not sound. There's a foam and a lot of wind blows. Blow now the caps look at the strip of land between the sea and the pond. Not all the way down. They come up on the other side. And you get over the caps to look up, you go over the little bridge right here. Is this uh, fresh water flats? No, salt water. Salt water. Salt water. Before you, many years ago, the road was around the edge of the pond and the sea come into Capsuluco. But 1995 hurricane blocked the road. So therefore, I had to do this road. How long since Capsuluco been here? Capsuluco, 1989. Official opened up in 1989. Welcome to the island hideaway. This, I'm not going to find this thing come back out. I don't tell me it's private. Horseback riding, go down to the beach. Right on the beach, you're going right on the beach. They, uh, you're going to water them too. Oh, nice. Water. This up, this project is still under construction. When this up project to be finished, complete the whole thing, it will be the number one spot in Angola. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Because right now, when they put up here, when they put up. A kids playground. Oh yeah. On the water park for kids. Theater hall, a theater hall, everything to put it up. Whoa. So when they finish, you know what it's gonna look like. Yeah. The gentleman has spent a lot of money. Where is he from? I read the budget up to what I studied, the probably one all the best buys in the United States. Oh, best buys. And look, you can look straight through the lobby at the St. Martin in the back. That was pretty. That was pretty, it's right? This? It's going to be a new resort. The yeah. guy from, um, who owns Best, Best Buy. Buy. You see it up the straight ahead. Here. He just upgraded his golf course. Greg Norman has started. Dr. Youth Medical Center. That's all the leaders goes to beautify. Oh. Dr. So to turn the top face, lift everything you get done right here. Oh, right here? I'm just below the paper. Oh, yeah. Yes. He on any of these signs is Seba anywhere. <laughs> Kingston is 1451 kilometers. Santo Domingo, Caracas, Bastia, Castries. Castries is St. Lucia, right? Yeah. That's super cool. Beautiful, beautiful overlook. And this is the main harbor into Anguilla. That's a 
southbound over there. Oh, uh, yeah. Like I said, Sergeant Dushu was a meeting Dushu like one of many years ago. Was the only payday that Angola had. Angola started tourism in 1984, and the South Pond died out in 1986, oh. two years after. So no more harvesting of the sons. I was a little boy growing up. I harvested that sun over there at Pond. Mm. And without an easy job. No, not. Not an easy job. The first day I went up in that pond to harvest that sun. When I get home, in the afternoon, I told my mom I'm not going back. Oh. <laughs> it's too hard. <laughs> because my shoulder to feel pain, my tie to feel pain, stood up all the time, you get a salt out the bottom of that water. But, I went home, had a shower, and went to bed. My mom came, she rubbed me up. She asked me, what's for me? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And, in, and in the middle of the night, I feel fresh again. And the time on clear, I was gone again. Ready for the next day. Yeah, until I was not going back. I was with the only baby. Um, take that cell off the leg. You get that here on it, you pull it here, you get your bite. Oh. So you had to come out, go straight in the sea, and all of the salt water, it just melts off. Right. Wow. The very old time church, but this church. Are they restoring it? Oh. And then you come. Bicycle tubes. You should cut a bicycle tube and you sew the end of it, and then the other part you push a finger up in it. Because if you go to rip the salt with your hand alone, you can cut up all the fingers. Oh, yeah. So that tube on your hand, on your fingers, see if you can get a lot of cuts on your fingers. Wow. Salt chuck. A salt chuck is just what's the nail chuck. Sometimes that sound is so sharp. Yeah. You don't have a shoe on your feet. You can stick in your feet to the piece. Okay. Yeah. You need a house on the south. Oh, yeah. You need a shovel in the south. Yeah. Many years have that south. You had to put that south in a box. Put it on your head. You get a, a, you get a, a towel or something, you a, a pillow. Put it on your head. Put a box on your head. Go out to trade in the barrel. When the barrel is filled, you call out the number. I think I want to see. You tell the keeper market and you dump that barrel. Those heaps were so tall that you could, it was handmade. You could have stayed young, young in that hill and see some Martin on the other side. I'm out of those heaps. Wow. Yeah. There's the traffic light. Yeah, yeah, like one that operates too. Yeah, six terms operating now. Yeah. <laughs> six of them. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Direct flights here. Direct, direct American, American comes from Miami yeah. to Anguilla every day. So, Renee, when you come back to stay by. American Airlines from Miami oh. right into Anguilla. Tomorrow. Yeah, the 
I said in the fish. Yeah. Dolphins, wahoo. Oh, that church is beautiful. church. Very pretty. On the right, the yellow building used to be the old cotton gin factory. Like I said, cotton was the main industrial many years ago. Right. We have the post office coming up. Government buildings above. On the left, we have commercial center. Different offices, this location. And you have the social security building. James Ronald Webster building. Mm -hmm. James Ronald Webster was the father of the nation, the revolution leader in 1967. And he's the one that started the social security network. Mm -hmm. That's why he's being up there. Then you have the flow telephone company. Then you have the bank. Now between the bank and flow, we have a green building up there. Yes, I go to a hotel. Easy to go in, hard to get out. Scouts and guy in quarters. Go to the for hard game. That's the great thing. The old boys school. You have the British who suffer in the wild sun dogs when you school. Ah, that's good. People's market. Little here, right here. The Anglican Church. That Catholic church was just beautiful. I reunited with Krista after nine years. We stayed in contact all this time and on very short notice, like one night's notice, she hooked us up with the taxi Nell who met us at the port. She hooked us up with her dad's restaurant right here on the best beach in Anguilla. And this was amazing. I got to meet her dad. The food, the service, the prices, we were treated like royalty here. It was just an amazing day. And we surely will be back to Anguilla. This is Elodia's on Shoal Beach into Anguilla. There's our group. We have lunch, drinks, and free cabana with cheers. And look at this beautiful beach. Isn't this just gorgeous? We just had a little rain shower pass, but who cares? We're already wet, we're on the beach. Look at the color of this water and it's crystal, crystal clear. Look at that. So now let me take you for a walk up the beach and see what's around the corner. There's a spa. So Shoal Beach is protected by shoal reef over there that's why it's so calm all the time this reminds me of Anagata if you've been to Anagata you'll know Anagata is just miles and miles of unspoiled beaches very small population on the island but it looks like this. Every time you turn a corner, there's more beach. But this is Shoal Bay in Anguilla. This is so pretty. Look how pretty this is. Mm -mm -mm. Shoal Bay has been written up as one of the top 10 beaches in the world. And you can see why the sand is so white, the water is so clear. It's just stunning. And look at my lobster salad. Mm, that is really good.
but he's Follow the adventures of CNC. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell.